into my room. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, come on. Capchagi again, not a natural. Nan Amu Mardo has so got such a chunnane banan dan an iyaki ga. Nor ponon sungan i hega dressa. Mebon ya 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 ya. Hey everyone, so I just moved to another place in Hoi An um, because I booked this place about two months ago, uh, I mean sorry, a month ago. <laughs> I booked two places um, at one time. <laughs> I don't know, sometimes I just do crazy things. But anyway, let's take a look outside I mean at the balcony this hotel is actually very close to the beach if you can see I'm not sure if you can see it's just right there so I can just walk across it's actually uh, well it's almost as close but maybe a little bit closer to the beach than the other villa Cam's villa the one I was staying at um, I think it's closer yeah it's slightly closer but yeah, anyway, this place is very close to Ken's place. Um, there's a pool. And even though Ken was saying like, don't move, just stay with me longer. I want to, but there's a pool. Uh, this place has a pool and I really want to swim, you know. And also for a change of scenery, you know, because I do get bored and I was there for almost a month, so it's time for a change. Yeah, but I think this room is okay. It's pretty. Let me show you the bathroom. I don't want you, uh, and I don't want to show you the bed because the pillows, <laughs> the pillows have the name of the hotel. <laughs> so you guys know that you know I don't really want people to know where I'm staying at, um, which hotel because I'm still here, you know. But for those of you who want to know, if you maybe it's not such a good good idea. Maybe much later on because Cam's place is very close to this place. <laughs> Sorry, maybe I'm just being paranoid. See, this is the volleyball that I got just yesterday and I only brought one luggage here because my other luggage is at Cam's villa. It was upstairs and somebody has to help me bring it down <laughs> uh, because there's no lift in that villa but there's a lift in this uh, hotel. Mm. At Cam's place, oh, what was I going to say? I'm a little bit distracted because there's some kids talking. Um, yeah, what I, what I was going to say was that, oh yeah, when I booked Cam's place, it was very last minute. And I was really upset with the other villa, if you've been following my Instagram you know what happened to me um yeah follow, follow me on my instagram by the way it's chelsea chill c-h-e-l-s-e-a-c-h-i-l-1-l um the link is also in the description box below oh there's someone showering <laughs> she's just i think she just oh well, she's going into the pool <laughs> but um yeah so it was like a very last minute booking because I wanted to leave the next day I want to leave the next day and I just went on like booking.com and straight away booked one that's 
that was listed as closest to me and and with good reviews and you know I really had such a good time at Cam's place I really did she was so sweet to me she, we have you know became friends to each other and we're still gonna see each other uh, again we're gonna go do something go sightseeing and stuff like that yeah so don't forget to hit like share and subscribe okay there are more adventures coming up <laughs> if you want to keep um, if you want to get updated with you know my little journey here oh, I love plants anyway I think I need to go back to Cam's place to collect my other luggage I hope she's around because I couldn't find her and I was at her and there was just one tick maybe she ran out of battery in the phone um, anyway I want to swim I want to swim maybe I'll swim later but when there's less less people but I think this place is nice. When I checked in, everybody was really nice to me. Oh yeah, and I didn't film uh, Cam's place when I, when I moved there because I had that issue with the last villa and the last thing on my mind was to, <laughs> to film uh, the place. And I just, I remember when I first got there, I just dropped my luggages and I said, I'm going to the beach. And I went to the beach right away because um, I needed to, you know, I needed some fresh air after what had happened. But, oh, yeah, I mean, I think I mentioned it in a couple of the live videos. Some of you may know what happened. But, yeah, I just don't want to tell the story again because I've told it like a couple of times already. Or a few times. <laughs> and on my Instagram story as well. Um... Anyway, long story short, they canceled my booking and listed me as like I didn't show up after I've paid them cash, after I've stayed there for like six days. So I wasn't happy about that. And then I, I told her nicely that she had to, you know, do something about that. She needs to reinstate the cancellation. And then after that, I went to have dinner. And then the next thing you know, somebody messed with my toothbrush because it looked so terrible. It was a new toothbrush. I think that they most likely used it to clean the toilet bowl. But anyway, I'm gonna go back to Cam's place and to collect my luggage and also, of course, to say goodbye. And I'll be right back. Guys, this um, balcony door doesn't lock, so I need to ask the reception what's happening. Um, I definitely have to make sure that it can be locked because, you know, I'm a female traveler and this is not too high up. People can actually climb. What do you think? Can people climb up here? <laughs> Maybe not, but still, I'm a little bit paranoid. Maybe I'll ask them later. I need to use the bathroom, but I wanted to show you guys, like every time when I, this is wet wipes, every time when I move to a new hotel, I will always like clean right here, the rims with <laughs> sorry that I'm showing you this <laughs> clean the rims with the wet wipes <laughs> so you don't know how many people have sat on it and also <laughs> oh I see oh, trash is right there um, I don't know how well they clean it it may look clean, but you never know, right? This is the shower space. 
Well, it looks pretty clean. Alright. And another thing that I would usually do is clean the headboard. <laughs> Because everyone's head has been here. <laughs> I'm not kidding when I say that I'm a, a bit of a germaphobe. Got that from my mom, by the way. Look, clean on top. Look at this. Okay, it's not that dirty, but still. And the side table. Gotta clean the side table for sure. See a lot of fingerprints. Maybe I should plug this in. Does it even work all the way this? Okay, cool. Because I like a little light, like on, switched on when I'm sleeping. And I'm over the board. Never touch. That'll be touching. And the thing is, I, I'm gonna be here for a month. This place, so. I don't know, these are like sandals that they give you, new sandals. And the table. I like that this table is big because you guys know I need a table to work to be comfortable. Um. <laughs> See? That was like a little stain. Somebody's Glass stain, cup stain. Come on now. I mean, if it's not your house and you just work, you're like a staff at a hotel. I don't think. I don't think you're going to really clean, clean, right? Because it's not your own place. You're just gonna clean whatever, whatever you can see, whatever that looks really dirty if I don't know that's just my here at the bottom because this is where I would touch to pull it out sorry this is like a cleaning video <laughs> and the chair oh my glass just fell okay it's fine um I clean the chairs. <laughs> if it's like a cushion chair, then I would usually put a what do you call? Um, like I have all these sarongs that I would put it on top of the chair. And then I'll sit on it. <laughs> I'm like cleaning. <laughs> this, I swear to you, but this is what I do every time. <laughs> every time I move to a new hotel or the villa or whatever. See? Look, there is... What do you call? Dust. There's dust here. I do this every time. And this is why I don't like to move around too much. Um, I stay at a place like one month or two months at a time because this is what I'm gonna be doing each time and that means I'll have to clean again who wants to clean <laughs> another thing I would normally clean of course this one the uh, what do you call remote control for the AC you know how many people have touched how many people have touched this AC remote control 
and I'll just it's always like next to me next to the bed so in case I get too hot or too cold I will you know like it's right next to me so I don't have to wake up and look for it and this is even though I don't watch the TV I still clean it and I will usually keep this in the that's a, I don't know it's not working obviously it's, I don't know why they put the phone there but I just put it in there because I know I'm not gonna use it and yeah what else yeah okay this one I don't think I'm gonna be using it because I have my own so have you seen all but I'll still kind of clean it just in case but whatever um what was I what was I saying oh I have my own like heater heater no water heater it's like a small pink one I'll show it uh, I'll show it to you guys next time it's in my other luggage so I will clean the handles <laughs> There's another handle right here because I'll be opening. Yeah, I'll be opening the. What do you call? Sorry, I. It, do you know that I cannot multitask if I'm doing something? Like I cannot do another thing. Most women can multitask, but I can't. <laughs> I'm so bad at it. I have to focus. So if I'm like doing something, I won't be talking. If I'm talking, I'm just like not really saying much, but I think this is fine. And then I would clean this as well, which is the door handle because I'll be touching it a lot another thing that I would normally clean is the switches as well this one, this one, this one. Yeah. and you know what else I do with the key card I always wash the key cards <laughs> if they give me two but Usually I just have one. I'll just wash it with soap. Uh-oh. There's the number of my room. I will blur it out. <laughs> just in case somebody knows or can recognize this hotel. Um, you know, I'm, I usually wear sandals in hotels. I didn't do that at Cam's house. Look, I'm gonna clean this as well. This one. This one right here. Oh, and also clean this one right here. Because I'm gonna be touching it a lot. Okay, how many... <laughs> how many wipes have I used already? Okay, last but not least, I always clean this handle as well. I clean right here. I mean, this is not my house, right? So, else I'm, I'm not gonna be using this. It's just that I'm traveling, so. Sorry. So, yeah. And I will clean here as well because. I might, I don't know yet, yeah, I might hang my, what do you call, my towels right here, so, yeah, okay, <laughs> it should be fine, <laughs> find this away. Oh yeah, I was saying that like with Cam, and then I will wash my hands. Yeah, because Cam's place, it's like a home 
it's like a villa slash home like you know i'm asian too we're not supposed to wear shoes in the house and so i didn't wear my shoes in the house just out of respect but normally i would prefer to wear my sandals in a place at a place that's not mine because if it's my own house it's gonna be so clean that i know it's clean because i clean it myself and i'll be much more comfortable just um not wearing shoes right i can i i also wouldn't mind sitting on the floor in my own house because i'm cleaning it so i know how clean it is anyway i think that's it but yeah i need to go back to cam's place i'll be right back love you guys oh one more thing that i forgot to clean in the fridge i usually clean the handle i don't know if i will be using the fridge maybe maybe not but just in case okay it looks clean i don't think a lot of people use the fridge yep so i'm walking back to cam's place and then i saw this hi what is this um is it a bed, a bed? yes oh yes. <laughs> is this dangerous can it fall huh is it dangerous put it on the bike hi you're so cute look at your your um mickey mouse hat so <laughs> cute pretty girl <laughs> Okay, see you later. Okay. Thank you. Company, um, where are you from? I'm from Malaysia. Malaysia. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I, I look, I, I, I look you. Yeah. Same Korea. Korea. Yeah. yeah. Everyone says or thinks I'm Korean. Yeah. Yeah, really? Okay. My uh, my my sister. Mm -hmm. My sister. Yeah. Yeah. Working company. Mm -hmm. Nanang. Mm -hmm. uh, company uh, Korea. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool. I think, yeah. <laughs> she might. Uncle. Uncle. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, no, no. My aunt. Aunt. Your aunt. Yeah. My aunt. Yes. Not uncle aunt. No, no aunt. Okay. All right. Stay safe. Bye. <laughs> She's posing with the bottle, my bottle of vodka. This is, it's a video. <laughs> this is sass. Sass or sa? Sass. Sass, right? Yeah. She's from um, Holland. She's a very sweet lady. And then I'm, um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah. So I walk back to Cam's place to pick up my other big luggage and I thought, hey, why don't we just kind of celebrate? I packed this already, my big luggage, and then I was thinking, yeah, I can take it out and then we'll have some drinks before I head back to the other hotel. This is Hanoi vodka. I wanted to try everything Vietnamese. Sorry, vodka. Hanoi. By the way, guys, I quit smoking. Do you know I haven't smoked in like six days already? That's so good. <laughs> I know. It's very hard to do for most people, but I usually, when I say I'm going to quit, I will quit. And it's usually for a long period of time. And then something is going to happen, like some stress or whatever. And then, boom, I will smoke and I'll smoke a lot. But then it's just for a short period of time and then I'll quit again for a long period of time. So I'm giving my lungs a break. Anyway, we're gonna drink this. So the idea was to add it inside <laughs> our beer. In the beer. In the Vietnamese beer. Let's see, wait. Ah. I hope my mom is not watching this. Is that enough or more? <laughs> You're hardcore. <laughs> no, uh, Cam is Cam is gonna bring us the small little glasses, the shot glasses. Mm. So we'll just try a bit. But it's nice to get them. 
Yeah, it's nice. Yes. But my mom is definitely gonna watch it. She always tells me I'm always the first one to watch it the moment you upload your videos. <laughs> the moment you post it. Did I put too much? <laughs> or do you want more? A little bit. A little bit more. <laughs> I don't know why I'm not pouring yours correctly. <laughs> Mine is so smooth. Yes. No spill, but yours is... No, you need a bit more. No. Maybe we'll have the shots later. We'll have the shots later. And how much is this one for Kahana? I bought this from the supermarket. Not the supermarket, the Wind Mart. That's the only convenience store that I will go to. I mean, I'll go to another one. He's okay, but... A convenience store where they have all the pricing already the prices yes. are there so that means they can't just simply um, mark up the prices if you want to know where it's but you have to go I think oh. yes there one is a good it's supermarket Jalan Kud it's like Jalan I just spoke it is, Malay I think, three minutes from here mm, that's one oh you mean over there yeah. before the bridge no it's, just it's over the bridge the corner. Uh, and then on the right side, there's mm -hmm. a supermarket. We sell cigarettes, food, or some chippies, and also. I think can. that's the one. No, this is like a proper convenience store with the AC, with the you know proper shelves and everything. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Did you pay for the bottle? This was so cheap. This was like hundred and I can't remember hundred and twenty or hundred and forty. Thousand dong. That's really cheap. It's super cheap. Yes. It's crazy cheap. And it says yes, Hanoi. So I, like, I would really want to try like Vietnamese stuff. I mean, Vietnam. I must try Vietnamese stuff. I see Carlsberg, Tiger, you know, those beer. But I would drink it in my own country. So why? I don't want. I want this is the whole point about traveling. It is to like try new things, try the countries. And try also stuff. Stuff yeah. From the yeah. yeah. If I want to just eat and drink whatever that I'm used to, I might as well just stay home in my own country, right? But sometimes I do miss. Sometimes I do miss like food at home and everything. So, uh, for example, I bought the instant noodles, which I was thinking maybe I should. I should. Um, how do you say? I should film it all four different instant noodles four different instant noodles and then but they are Vietnamese instant noodles they are different yeah they are different so also I really want to try it no it's from Vietnam but they are different different noodles in Thailand yes. and Vietnam yes oh, yes and like those instant cup noodles yes i understand yeah and they have the malaysian ones they have the thai ones they have oh, the korean really? ones they got the vietnamese one and i bought like three or four i think and i was thinking maybe i should film this to try everything yeah and just tell you guys how it tastes like so next time when you come to vietnam you know which one to buy if you want to buy and whenever i miss home i start to feel like i want to eat I start to crave for this type of noodles, like instant noodles kind of stuff because I used to, that was the first, uh, how do you say, my first time learning how to cook was instant noodles, you yeah, know? That's easy, you only put water with it. <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> eggs, whatever. Oh, yes, and as an yeah. Asian, it's so common for us to make our own noodles, instant noodles. That's like the first thing all Asians will learn how to make them it's yeah. always the instant noodles yeah but usually i make it very fancy right i'll add eggs i'll add, add ham i'll add cheese i'll add all kinds of like vegetables yes. but you know but i'm you know i don't right now i cannot cook so the cup noodles will be the best bet i love the cup noodles do you want to eat i love oh them. maybe we do that <laughs> Maybe I take out the cup noodles, I put it out here. Oh, really? And then we try. We can try them. Yeah? yeah, let's do that. That's our dinner. <laughs> <laughs> the cup noodles. <laughs> There's four. So you eat two and I eat two. Oh, yes, we 
can do that. Yes. Yeah, yeah. And then we ask Cam to make us um, eggs to, to put, put in, in it. In oh, it. Yes, that's a good dinner. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because I was like missing home and then I was like, you know what? And I went to, to buy some tissues, whatever, and I saw the cup noodles. I've already seen it before, but, and I was like, no, it's not the healthiest food to eat, but it's always good to have some cup noodles with you just in case sometimes I wake up in the middle of the night and I'm hungry and everything is closed, you know, because my sleeping sleeping schedule is kind of weird sometimes because I travel like for example I went to Bangkok right and then I went to Bangkok and I didn't sleep for like 24 okay. hours or longer oh I'm cutting you off sorry <laughs> <laughs> that's <Aww>. no problem <laughs> oh you're so beautiful you're so photogenic um, but anyway yeah, so that messed up with my sleeping pattern. Yes, because you didn't I didn't sleep, sleep for, for 24 hours, if not longer. <laughs> and it's like, okay, that messed my... Just even though the time zone, the time difference is about the same, but still it messed up my sleeping pattern. Okay, so we're going to do that, okay? We do that. We're going to get... I'm going to get the instant noodles. We're going to make them. And you... I'll give you two, and I'll, I'll eat the other two, and you tell us... How it, how it is. Yes. yes. Yay. To be continued.